Tourism could be an interesting uh, industry in the next couple of years. Fortress Australia starts as tarnished, says our tourism chief. Australia has been a little bit ridiculed around the world for its strict COVID-19 border closures and rules and could fail to regain its share of global tourism dollars even when the border reopens in a fortnight, the head of Tourism Australia has warned. Look, I'm going to go on a limb and say uh, we've been here for 704 days locked in here. It ain't that bad. I don't know. I, I, I think if you... No, I, I think there's a perception. There has been some reputational damage. <laughs> like, do I want to go to a country that may or may not throw me into a hotel? Because yeah. people hear the worst of stories, right? Of course. Yes. And, and there was the, the, the flight at, at Christmas where the plane load of passengers oh, yeah. from New South Wales got thrown into hotel quarantine. They're all vaccinated and then the next minute they went, oh, that's a really bad look, let's let them loose. And then, of course, there's yeah. Western Australia that no one can get to. I don't think it's as bad as it's being made out to be, yeah. but people need to remember and those making these rules need to remember that international tourists have a choice where they spend their money. And they spend a lot of money. They spend, I mean, for example, yeah, they do. I could go into, <laughs> I'm sorry, I could go into detail. I'm like, that's going to take way too much time and Jenna's going to kill me. I wouldn't do that to you. <laughs>